Now let, let's try this problem based on geometry. Here, find AD if radius of the circle with center O is 2 root 3 and CE is 2 cm and CB is tangent to the circle at P. That means this must be 90 degree because uh, the angle between radius and tangent is always 90 degree. So this angle is 90 degree and uh, ED is diameter that means this angle will also be 90 degree because that is angle in semicircle. Now we can uh, make uh, three relationships. The first is this AB square plus BC square is equal to AC square, right? And uh, AB square is what? AB is nothing but diameter. Diameter will be 4 root 3. So AB square will be uh, 4 root 3 square, square that is 48. So this is 48 plus BC square is equal to AC square. The next relation is, uh, see BC is tangent and CA is second, right? BC is tangent, CA is second. So uh, you just, you can recall this tangent second theorem that is BC square is equal to CE into CA. CE into CA or AC. Or CE is actually 2 that is given. So BC square is actually 2 AC. Right? So instead of a BC square, I can put 2 AC over here. So that's AC square minus 2 AC minus 48 is equal to 0. If we can factorize, that is AC minus 8. 8 and 6 so AC minus 8 and AC plus 6 is 0 so AC will be 8 right so BC square is equal to 2 AC so 2 into 8 that is 16 so we got AC that is 8 AC is 8 CE is 2 that means AE is 6 now BC uh, we don't actually need ED we know that is uh, 4 root 3 now this angle is 90 degree, this is hypotenuse, we can put up the Pythagoras theorem. So that is 48 minus 36, so that's 12, that is AD, uh, AD square, so AD will be root 12 or we can say 2 root 3. Okay, so I hope you are clear.